inside and welcome to Cribs. Cribs Glendette, Glendette edition. All right, let's roll inside, let's see what the homies are up to. Just got home, soaked out in the town, you know. Got some greens, smack. All right, first of all, you can see G for Glendette and Gangsta. It's got it right out there, out front, anybody wants to come by. Just gotta check on the gate. Security guard's right here. He's ready to see your pass. Better be VIP, baby. All right, come on in. We got ultimate security system here. As you can see, a key goes right in the knob there. It's a special key, electronic. Only one person has it, and that person is me. All right, oh, you can see out here we got a stack. We like to go au natural heating systems here at the Glendet. You can see we got a big pile of heating uh, type of sticks here. I don't know who, uh, some guy just brings them by, so he's done a real nice job there. Hey, right, come in and watch your step. All right, all right, so before we get too far into the mansion here, we got a little lounge area, a little mudroom area, you know? Get to sit back, relax, take your boots off, peel them off after a big day, you know? Chill out. I like to throw on my down booties right here. And that's how I really chill in my crib, with down booties on. This is our number one heating area facility. Uh, comes in real handy, keeps the place nice, centrally warm, all that kind of stuff. Also, one of two ladies' rooms I like to keep up in the joint here. Sometimes throw a little, oh, it's got that paparazzi back again. Go oh, bust a cap in your ass! Ah! Yeah, that happens. All right, all right. So, yeah, sometimes we'll bring some ladies out. I like to throw down a bearskin carpet right here, right in front of the fire, real nice romantic. Like a couple candles, put on some acoustic seal, you know, really get a thing on. All right, into the kitchen now. And now we're in the kitchen. As you can see, we got fully uh, all the facilities here. Everything you possibly need. We got our operating sink. Uh, water usually works sometimes. Whatever. Drain works every time. We also got our uh, nice Viking. Uh, we got our front range here. We got our ovens. Cook anything you want in there. Look at this. We got some leftovers from last night. It's all good, baby. It's ready to go. I got a chef on hand too. You know, he's around here 24/7. So if I ever get hungry, he just cooks me up some stuff. So. Let's see what we got in the fridge. I don't even know, man. The chef deals with that stuff. Oh, yeah. We got some old Millie's. Yeah. What else? We got some Jaeger. This is part of the liquor cabinet here. Some Malibu. This is the good stuff. The ladies love this. Makes them think they're in the islands. We really get the bikini on and all that jazz. Pour it all over them sometimes. Dessert. Oh, yeah. Little melted macaroons all over the ladies. You know. You know how it is. We got all kinds of goods in here. These are my favorite chimneys. Gotta get your chimneys in, you dog. You're out here in the bush, man. Get your chimneys in, get like about 10, 12 of these things in you for lunch. Dang, you feel good after that. You got the regular assortment, you know, it's all good, it's all good. Ooh, you've got some uh, itchy bands in there, man. All the itchy bands you can eat, dog. All right, move over to the liquor cabinet here. That's where we keep the rest of our fine liqueurs, man. So we've got some Gordons, we've got some Baileys, you know. Jack Dent, that's gone because we love that shit around here, you know, we drink that shit all the time. Oh, what else? We got some Gibsons. Oh, yeah, gotta have your vodka, dog. You know what vodka goes good with? Bam! The Bulls Balls. Also, don't forget, bang, Red Rain sponsoring this joint. You know, MTV Cribs, you gotta get up on your Red Rain, dog. You gotta get it in you. So, yeah, that's pretty much the kitchen here. As you can see, it's laid out pretty sweet. Got some cupboards for all the dishes and all that kind of jazz, too. And always safety first, right? Oh, yeah. Kids, always got to have a sweet up fire extinguisher in your crib, in case you know, be blazing fat doobies and whatever and pass out playing the PlayStation, you know, you can put that out right away, brother. Kids, you know, you got to look out for that kind of thing, so I don't know how that goes back, but we'll let the uh, butler take care of that jazz. All right, so let's just move into the living room area here. You see my peeps, Sean, homie, just up hanging, you know, that's how we roll, got some magazines. Got some Tara Reid up in this joint, you know. All the latest magazines from about four years ago, you know, all the FHMs, the Maxims, a couple ski rags too, whatever, you know, we got it all. Pretty neat sleeping quarters here, you know, this is where we bring the ladies in. Me and the ladies usually take this one over here, it's pretty sweet, folds out, you know. You can get about five or six ladies across there, no problem. Big sandwich, put some macaroons on them, you know, some Malibu, get it on, you know. We've got some instruction manuals here. 
You could, you could get better sex, man. You could get more sex. You get more often. I like to try this one out sometimes, you know. Just keep the clothes on, kind of. Just rub up. It's all good, brother. It's all deadly. All right, Cribs. Thanks for stopping by. Coming to buy a CR Mad Up pad. We got some Sasquatch ladies coming by, though, in about a half hour. So y'all got to get out of here. Peace, y'all. Time down for some action.